What's up guys, Sir the Great here bringing you another installment of Medieval 2 Total War Pro Games and that's gonna be 2 vs 2, me and my ally DS Ire Valakian vs Scotland commanded by Green Manality and Hungary in the command of Nameless Order. So overall 4 strong players and uh, let's take a look at army composition because it's this battle is gonna start early on as usual in my uh, commentaries. So we've got myself commanding Holy Roman Empire, Ruthless Teutonic Knights, Dismodern Imperial Knights, Landsnake Pikes and two units of Peasant Crossbows just to cover basic missile aspect. Let's take a look at the Venice army. We've got Venetian Heavy Infantry, uh, looks like with armor upgrade, uh, Knights Hospitaller, uh, Peasant Crossbows behind the lines and Pike Militia uh, setting up on left flank, uh, then uh, we've got the Scotland, Green MLT with solid forces consisted of uh, General's Bodyguard, Gallo Gleich, this modern Fidel Knights, General's Bodyguard, Knights Hospitaller and the rest stuff which uh, Scotland usual uh, is brought with. And finally we've got Hungary, standard build, General's Bodyguard, Ro Royal Bandarium with armor upgrade, uh, dismounted uh, Fidel Knights, I believe, Crowd Axemen, no sorry, they are Shivari Knights, and two units of uh, Pavis Crossbow Militia and they are about to throw fierce volley of pots, but here comes my crossbows, they are suffering really heavy losses, but let me put normal speed on because you are gonna see really sweet charge made by my Teutonic Knights, so I'm pushing to, I'm telling my uh, ally to push as well, so here comes my Teutons, uh, let's see uh, which church impact will be better. Bang! Beautiful, but looks like I won this uh, church, at least I think so, let's take a look at uh, uh, how they call the balance of power, it's still even, but I managed to push my cavalry out and right now I'm gonna send them to the flank and see that majority of my heavy cavalry forces is still untouched and here comes my pikes and they are gonna just absolutely blucher this shivardy knights and uh, it's really tough to counter holy roman empire in all periods because we are playing in all periods uh, and we got some route of shivardy I mean royal banner but we uh, were playing this on um, 6 to cavalry, 15 key each player all period, so it's most common rule set. Here comes my Fidel Knights uh, taking out this um, Pavis Crossbows. My Teuton is far away, but ready to answer. His cavalry is surrounded. Uh, well, the this is kinda dangerous position for me, because I see that Scottish cavalry is coming to the rescue, but I know that uh, Valachian or Wallachian or Valachian or whatever how his call is uh, keeping them busy, he's not winning uh, and now, uh, right now he's gonna lose his infantry because Green MLT is waiting for this sweet shit, Venice shit, but here comes my cavalry and now 5 hammer and anvil at two min with, within 2 minutes and his general is dead, so my cavalry did amazing job using secondary weapon, using this uh, down maces and obviously right now I can help my ally out because as you can see these guys are shaken. Venetian heavy infantry is great but they have low morale, so at this moment important us and my general right now pass away. So uh, this uh, my general isn't life anymore but I slaughtered this Hungarian and, uh, and, and I got still numerous forces of heavy infantry left. They are going after my crossbows, I don't care, they are cheap units and they did the job properly. But right now balance of power is a little in our favor. I'm gonna try to uh, get rid of this generous bodyguard and it's broken because Green MLT brought two units of generous bodyguard. It's often, uh, you know, commonly used in... Uh, uh, high period, I mean in all periods. Here comes my Teutonic Fanatics Bank. They got wrecked, but they got some kills, so that's very important. Here comes uh, Knights Hospitaller. They are about to help a Hungary, but will this will this be enough? Here comes uh, uh, Venice uh, Infantry. A little bit, you know, uh, fuck it up with positioning, but. Uh, their enemy's cavalry are depleted, and they aren't simply enough. 
to stop my uh, to stop my chargers. Venice is holding on hand themselves really well, uh, and uh, Venice won cavalry fight. So good job there. But slowly but constantly, uh, the Scotland are wrecking through. Whoa, that was merciless. But slowly but constantly, Venice is losing. So I'm gonna help them. Help them. Whoa, my tongue is broken. Help them with my Teutonic Knights, and they are about to just wipe, to just slice through this, uh, slice through the Scottish pikes, and see this chain route, and the battle is over at this point. I still have some pikes. Uh, Venice still got the generous bodyguard. Look at this. Are, are they about to charge at these pikes? Look at this. What a micro issue, bark. Whoa, Lansnake pikes plus one for today. So I barely enjoy games where I carry game and where my first initial church is so amazing, like in this one. If I will repeat this in all games I play every day, I will be master of this fucking game. But seems I can't do this perfectly, so don't uh, bear in mind that I have right to be happy uh, fighting uh, and showing this one uh, as the one of the good examples how to play properly and take on heavier armored enemies. Uh, Venice is uh, going after the last uh, unit of Hungary and uh, GG, well played. Uh, very quick um, action started early on. We abs I absolutely blushed Hungary but I had trouble helping out to Venice. Apparently uh, this was closer game when it was fought live than uh, than uh, now when I'm coming like this like this, but I'm not giving a shit. I'm just saying what do I felt and what do I feel right now. So uh, battle is over, but fight is still going on. Uh, so lesson for today: uh, if you are lesson for today, work in team. In other uh, words, teamwork is most important in. When it comes down to team battles, it's not obvious as it looks like because I play every day and most of my allies are doing uh, very bad at this matter. They are not listening to me, they aren't uh, communicating through, uh, through team chat and overall uh, they need to uh, work in team to achieve victory because it's team game, right? So, thank you for watching, hope you enjoyed that mess it up commentary, but very fun battle and very fun, uh, I enjoyed commentating this, I hope you did the same watching. Uh, if you did, leave a like, subscribe, share, comment, hate, blame or anything, everything is welcome except meaningless hate, uh, constructive criticism is welcome, uh, have a nice weekend, I hope you guys uh, watch next videos and I'll see you guys in the next one. Cheers uh, and Auf Wiedersehen!